Hello friends, welcome in Cool IT Help. Guys, in this tutorial, I will tell you how to download and install FFmpeg on Windows. Guys, let's get started. So first, we have to download FFmpeg. Okay, so just open your favorite browser and copy this URL from the description and paste in the address bar and press enter. Then you will see the download page of FFmpeg. Okay, so uh, we will be here. You can see this is the download page of FFmpeg and lots of things is available. Like uh, we have uh, different packages for different kind of machine. If you have a Linux machine, then you can use the Linux one. We have uh, OS X version as well. And uh, we are going to install uh, Windows. So we will choose this one. Okay, now once you click, you will reach on this place and this is the ffmpeg download page here uh, we have to select the architecture which kind of machine we have if you have a 64-bit machine so you can choose and if you have 32-bit then you will choose 32-bit architecture and we going to download the static build okay after selecting that architecture just click here on this blue big button okay so uh, downloading will uh, start you can see on the left corner and uh, it will take uh, few minutes uh, it depends on your uh, internet speed if you have a powerful uh, internet speed then it will be downloaded in a minute uh, otherwise it will take a bit longer okay so here we are waiting uh, for uh, this downloading okay it's going to be completed in next five seconds okay so now uh, downloading is finished and i am uh, going to copy this uh, folder in a separate place so you guys can uh, copy anywhere uh, in your uh, drive location and uh, we will uh, uh, extract this zip file and then you can see you will have this folder now go inside this folder folder and we will see what we have inside the web okay we have these three exe file ffmpeg.exe ffplay.exe and ffprobe.exe so first we are going to configure ffmpeg on windows so we will discuss only about the ffmpeg but in later video i will tell you the use of ffplay.exe and ffprobe.exe as well okay uh, we have just copied the path up to the bin folder and now i'm going to set the environment variable okay so go to the my pc do a right click and go to the properties and here you have to click on the advanced settings okay and then you will see this window here you have to click environment variable and this window will open okay now we have to find out the path variable so here it is and uh, we will click on the edit button button okay then uh, we will click here on the new so uh, new editable text box will appear so we will paste the path of uh, exe up to bin folder okay but uh, right here uh, there's a folder which has a little bit big name so i will uh, modify this one okay so uh, simply uh, we ha you have to uh, paste the path up to bin folder okay so here i am renaming the folder okay just click on the ok and minimize this window and you, you can see i will also rename this folder because uh, i have changed the name inside the environment variable so it will be same as we have in the environment variable okay it's done guys setup is ready now we will test it okay just open the command prompt okay so you will see this black and white window and uh, here you have to type ffmpeg and press enter then you will see this summary and uh, you can see ffmpeg version n uh, 94057 copyright 2000 2009 ffmpeg developers and there's some uh, inbuilt uh, libraries de details will be displayed here that means your uh, ffmpeg is installed successfully and you guys can uh, pick up my any video of ffmpeg and proceed with that one and perform your desired task with the ffmpeg 
I hope you guys found this video useful. So guys, please share with your friends as well. And uh, do subscribe my channel. So, and uh, press this notification bell icon as well. So you will get the latest video updates ASAP. So guys, keep watching Cool IT Help. I will bring more useful videos on my channel. Till then, bye-bye.